The head of the National Investment Authority, Haider Machia, stressed the importance of Iraq, joining international agreements to enhance the investment sector, pointing out that Iraq has provided real guarantees to attract foreign investments. Machia said, in his speech, during the launch of the National Investment Commission conference in cooperation with the United Nations Development Program, that Iraq's accession to the international settlement agreement resulting from international mediation and disputes that was signed in 2024 will contribute to achieving the goals of sustainable development and encouraging the increasing use of international mediation as a means effective for settling cross-border disputes for the purpose of maintaining trade and investment relations between the parties involved in the investment process. He added, this agreement has a pivotal dimension, foremost of which is finding an alternative method to litigation procedures before international arbitration bodies in disputes arising from investment, especially since Iraq joined in 2015 the International Center for the Settlement of Investment Disputes between States and Citizens of Other Countries, and this, it will give foreign investors the right to resort to the Washington Center. He continued, also, the Republic of Iraq's accession to the New York Convention on the Recognition of Foreign Judgments of 1958 means completing all the legislative environment necessary to provide real guarantees and protection for foreign investors. And this will positively reflect on attracting foreign capital to Iraq, which aims at the process of construction and reconstruction and will raise Iraq's classification. He explained, this agreement enhances the Iraqi investment reality because it includes many international and qualitative strategic investment opportunities that impose contracts with specialized foreign companies for investment purposes. This requires Iraq to provide legal protection to those companies by resolving disputes in the event that they arise from investment contracts that it is imposed by state institutions on these companies, which prefer to resort to international arbitration to guarantee their rights. As stipulated in Article 27 of Investment Law No. 13, he pointed out, Iraq's accession to the International Mediation Agreement, Singapore Agreement, is necessary to attract foreign investments and achieve intended development especially in light of Iraq's transformation and dependence on a free market economy. This agreement will also create a legal framework that allows reliance on agreements. The settlement resulting from mediation is easily implemented by all countries. Machia stressed that the legal department at the National Investment Commission and the investment authorities in the governorates will work to include international investment contracts based on mediation mechanisms in disputes related to investment before resorting to international arbitration which will send a message of reassurance to foreign investors and foreign companies to proceed with resolving disputes related to these contracts in an easier way than entering into international commercial arbitration procedures. He pointed out that the Republic of Iraq's accession to the International Commercial Arbitration Convention and the Singapore Mediation Convention, in addition to concluding many agreements to encourage and protect mutual investments between Iraq and many international countries, made Iraq occupy the fourth place in the classification of foreign direct investment and the best emerging markets to invest in 2024. He stressed that, the noticeable improvement in the investment climate in Iraq comes as a result of the government's efforts to enhance the economic and investment sector in attracting foreign investments, calling on foreign companies, foreign investors and businessmen to visit Iraq to learn about the investment opportunities included in the investment map and to attend the Iraq Investment Forum that will be held next November, which will launch more than 100 investment opportunities with complete approvals, and to see the advantages and guarantees that the investment law will provide to investors.